I just saw Pete's Dragon. Now, if you're looking for a movie that's uh, good for the family, it actually doesn't have to be just for the family. I, I really enjoyed it myself. It's, it's a good movie. It's very different than the original Pete's Dragon. Essentially a different story, other than the fact that you've got this little boy, Pete, who is essentially raised by a dragon, Elliot, and uh, that that really is the the only thing that's the same. Um, the movie has uh, Bryce Dallas Howard, um, Robert Redford as uh, essentially the Mickey Rooney uh, character from the original one, the guy who has seen a dragon believes in dragons. Uh, Bryce Dallas Howard finds the little boy in the forest, and they try to figure out where he's come from. Uh, turns out he's been there for six years, survived for six years. People think on his own, but of course he had the help. He had a friend. He had Elliot the Dragon. Now, this movie is surprisingly emotional. I mean, the original Pete's Dragon also, you know, had those moments, especially near the end where, you know, the dragon has to leave, uh, that you found sad. But this one was tugging at your heart stream strings the whole time. I mean, the very end, you're like hoping they keep the lights down in the theater so people can't see <laughs> the redness in your eyes. Um, anyway, I, it was a very good movie. Uh, if you're going to score it out of 10, I'd say I'd give it at least an 8 out of 10. And um, I highly recommend you go see it. Go see it, especially if you have kids. Uh, they'll enjoy it as well. Go see it if you don't have kids. You'll enjoy it.